Casey Cagle talks about his Georgia values, but he championed tax cuts for a strip club. Well, here is what is going on now as politics begin to heat up in the race for the governor's office. One candidate has bought an ad depicting another candidate dancing at a strip club. The candidate who bought this is a political newbie, and the ad takes on the Republican frontrunner. Here's 11 Alive's Doug Richards to give us a closer look. As strip clubs go, the Claremont Lounge is a legend. Last year, the 53-year-old club reopened following a renovation. A government historic preservation tax break helped fund the renovation. And it inspired this ad. Casey Cagle talks about his Georgia values, but he championed tax cuts for a strip club. The ad does overlook a pertinent fact, which is that the Claremont Lounge sits in the basement of the Claremont Hotel, a building which has been mostly vacant for much of the last decade. And the renovation that benefited the strip club in the basement has also converted the once blighted hotel into a potential showcase. Political before, newcomer Clay Tippins created the ad. But it's about more than the strip club. It's the, about that entire building. Your tax dollars, my tax dollars, were used, in fact, for redeveloping a strip club. So it's no wonder that this guy's in fifth place and hasn't cracked 5% in the polls. Brian Robinson works for Kegel, the, the GOP's frontrunner. He's being dishonest. It's not stretching, it's being dishonest. Hunter Hill talks like he's Rambo. But he's really a Benedict Arnold. The ad the also control. attacks candidate Hunter Hill, a former Army Ranger who fought in Iraq and Afghanistan. Tippins is a we former Navy run. SEAL. Well, I think it brings great dishonor on his own service to suggest that, that my combat tours in Iraq and Afghanistan uh, link me with a traitor. Are portrayals like this part of what sort of offend people about politics? What offends me is if I end up with a leader that's a liar. And early voting is just 11 days away. Doug Richards, 11 Alive News.